Hey, what's good? What's the verdict? Shalom, all praise to the Most High, to all my 12 tribes of Israel. You know my slogan, guilty by association. Um, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe for subscribe, so subscribe to my channel. Shout out to everybody that have been subscribing, that have been subscribing back, commenting, doing the same, the same exact thing, the same exact thing I'm doing on my channel. I'm participating and engaging with everybody else. If I haven't, let me know. Um, but anyway, man, the streets want to know what does slime them out means in street terms. All my 12 tribes of Israel. You know my slogan, guilty by association. Um, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe for subscribe, so subscribe to my channel. Shout out to everybody that have been subscribing, that have been subscribing back, commenting, doing the same, the same exact thing, the same exact thing I'm doing on my channel. I'm participating and engaging with everybody else. If I haven't, let me know. Um, but anyway, man, the streets want to know what does slime them out means in street terms? Slime them out. Um, I coined slime them up. Slime them out. That coined that phrase for Memphis, Tennessee, because Pooh Sicey definitely was one of the ones that actually, you know, um, made that made that catchphrase inf infamous, you know what I mean, in the streets. So I got to give him credit for it. Um, he actually was one of the first one I heard saying that slime really means because slime really means homie, you know what I mean. Especially in blood terms, it was slime was used in blood terms on the East Coast, like New York and New Jersey, Connecticut, all through there, to uh, identify each each uh, blood member. You know what I mean? That was riding with the red team, and then it made his way down south for thanks to Lil Wayne, and then Young Thug kind of globalized it, you know. And made it his twist on it, and everybody else started putting a twist on it, whatever. But the word was corn out of Harlem, Harlem, New York. Vital, Vital was one of the first artists to put it in music. You know what I mean? Fart, no. Noriega was one of the first artists to actually put it in music. But Vital was one of the first ones to actually push the, the lingo. You know what I mean? So, with that being said, I ain't gonna hold up too long. Um, slime my mouth basically means cutthroat. Um, um, Double cross you, triple cross you. Basically, that's basically what it mean, man. You, you, you um, you about to get shortcut, man. You know what I'm saying? Or you could say back door too, whatever the case may be. But more than likely, slime mount means, you know, whether he your homie or not, you about to cut throat. You feel what I'm saying? So you know, finding your homies or whoever you doing, you ain't you you doing doing dealings with. That you about to slime homeboy out, you know what I mean, and get whatever you want out of him. It could be work, money, jewels, whatever, whatever the case may be. You know what I'm saying? You about to cut throw him, and it is what it is. That's just what it is. Pardon me, but for the most part, you know, y'all gotta understand what other. Yo, gang. What's the verdict? Yo, gang. You gotta understand though, like for the most part. It's all about understanding. When you hear that word lingo, you hear that lingo, it's either going to be with you or against you, meaning it depends what type of person you're dealing with. you dealing with some, some grimy individuals, be on point, stay dangerous. You know what I'm saying? Because you never know you might be the one at the, at the end of that gun. You know what I'm saying? Or being the one slimed out. You get me? Cause you either gonna survive it or you not. You know what I'm saying? I'm just, that's just how it gonna go, man. But me personally, I ain't too big on um sliming, sliming niggas out, especially if they ain't if they my homie. Um, but you know, I ain't that got put in that predicament where I have to slap my own homie out. You know what I'm saying? And I thank God, you get me. So I don't know how to feel to slime somebody out that I that I break bread with. You know what I'm saying? But. Other other niggas ain't that wasn't with the car or that wasn't in our in our establishment. Yeah, you got lined up. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. We definitely lined you up. You know, we got what we we got out of you. You know what I'm saying. And I don't glorify it or nothing like that. You know, everybody say that, but I really don't glorify it. You know, um, cause <laughs> I 
I've been slimed out before, you get me? I'm just here to tell y'all. I'm just here to, I lived, I survived it because I know how to survive certain, certain, under certain pressure. I know how to get up out of them certain situations. I ain't perfect, you get what I'm saying? And I'm not super gangster. You give me some meaning, like anybody could get it. And that term's fit for me too. I fit the description as well. So, there y'all have it, man. Slime them out basically means cutthroat, cross you, backdoor you, line you up, set you up, whatever they got to do to get the upper hand. You know what I mean? But anyway, man, God bless y'all. Comment in the comment section if y'all feel I was wrong or oh, y'all want to add on to what I said. Anywhere it goes, man, stay dangerous, stay stealthy, stay on point, stay on 50, you hear me?